Hey guys, this is just a quick disclaimer before we get into today's video. I was testing out my new camera and capture card and there were a few technical issues. So the quality of today's video is not the best, but it's also not the worst and I hope that you guys enjoy it anyways. And my camera dies in the middle of the video, just just FYI. It, it was kind of a disaster, but it's okay. Uh, I hope that you guys don't mind and yeah, enjoy the video. Hey everyone, it's me Tiger. Welcome or welcome back. Today we have our new camera. Well, actually it's my old camera, but I finally got a capture card so we can use my fancy camera in our videos. So yeah, welcome or welcome back to Cozy Saturday where we play cozy games every week on every Saturday. This Saturday, we're going to be playing Lemon Cake again. Yes, I have played this before, but I wanted to play it again because a lot of you requested a part two to this game, and I've actually been playing a lot off camera. As you can see, I'm on day 46 of my bakery, so I'm really excited to show you guys what I've been doing, what's changed on the bakery, and also we can try to unlock some stuff together. So first off, the kitchen area looks a lot different. That's because I've gotten a lot of stuff. Let me just just clean up this mess before I show you guys. We have eggs now, we have milk now, we even have a freezer, and we have all three um, ovens um, unlocked so we can actually cook three things at once instead of like one thing at once. I'm gonna go ahead and fill those up with firewood. But also, look at this, we have so many display shelves now, we even have an extra table and a coffee stand, and we also have cats. I mean, could it get any better than this? And we have a lot of recipes. I'm still cooking the same things because these are like my comfort items. I know how to cook them. It's very easy. Oh, and yeah, look at this. I've also gotten a lot of new plants. We have grapes. We even have a cow and we have this cart so we could easily transport um, our ingredients into the kitchen. It's It's been a lot happening. Oh, look, our cow is getting dirty. Let's Go ahead and clean him and also our chickens. But yeah, a lot has happened since you guys have last seen the bakery. It's coming along really nicely. I love playing this game. It's so addicting. It's just really chill. It's kind of a comfort game for me at this point. So yeah, I thought I would show you guys kind of what's happening on my bakery lately. We can play a few days together, try to get uh, some more stuff unlocked. I've been saving up for a cat cafe upgrade and also automatic sprinklers so I don't have to keep watering my plants all the time. If I had the sprinklers, they would just stay watered um, automatically. Let me know in the comments if you guys have played Lemon Cake. It's really, really fun. I'll link the Steam store page down below. I think it's only available on Steam. Also, look, I forgot to tell you guys that I dyed my character's hair pink. It was blue in the last video and I changed it. So um, we have all of our display shelves ready. Let me just cook up two more things. Oh, we don't have a cherry. Let me go grab one really quick. And look at that. Our ovens are out of firewood. Let me go ahead and restock all of these. Get some fire going. And we'll go get one last batch of ingredients. And then we'll go ahead and open the store. So let me just water these plants while the store opens and our customers flow in. First customers of the day. Here we go. All of our plants are watered. Everything stocked nice and good. Um, let me go ahead and just start baking a blueberry bagel since somebody's already buying one. I like to uh, grab these that I have on the table and then I start another one. That way it's just like a nice flow and we have uh, constant stock of our food items. I don't know if that makes any sense. This is my strategy, okay? This is how I play this game. Um, oh, okay, they want a, a cherry jelly. Let me go ahead and whip that up for you. See, I put it in the oven, and then I grab our extra one here and serve it to them, and then I'll put the one in the oven back right there. So, yeah, we just have, like, constant food. I'm not gonna brush the animals because it takes too much time, and I don't have that time, and I don't use any of the stuff from the animals anyways, so I'm not worried about it. Oh, we need a soft serve. Oh no, that actually uses milk. I forgot, I just got this recipe. I was just saying we don't use that stuff, but we do use that stuff now. Oh no, okay, this is about to burn. Let me put this back. Okay, so to make this, we need milk and we need sugar. This is my first time making the ice cream cone. I haven't made it yet, but yeah, you put it in the freezer and then voila. It's out and it's ready. We can go ahead and serve our customer. And this customer wants a 
grape popsicle. I just now unlocked the freezer, so I'm getting used to making the frozen food. Oh, let me put this here. And then we need sugar. Oh, and the other person also wants a great popsicle. Everybody's like wanting ice cream today for some reason. I mean, I'm cool with it. It's pretty easy to make. I don't have to like cook it in the oven. Okay, here you go. Oh, sorry. The table in front of you is so dirty. We need to start cooking some stuff because our display windows are getting really, really empty and the lunch rush is starting. Oh no, this this game gets so fast paced, especially after you start like unlocking more and more stuff. It can get really stressful, but I still think that it's really cozy. I really have a lot of fun playing this. If you guys are in the Discord server, you might have seen me playing it like all the time. Oh no, oh no, our ovens are out of firewood. But yeah, if you guys are in the Discord server, you might see me playing it. Um, yeah, I play, I try to play every day so I can get as much stuff unlocked. I really want to unlock everything so I can say that I beat this game. Okay, there's a lot of orders. Um, I'm getting stressed. Okay, who ordered that? There you go. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and throw together some marshmallow treats really fast. These are really quick to make. That's why I kept them on the menu. That way when there's a huge rush, I can just like throw these out here really quick. Let's go ahead and serve all of our customers coffee because if you give them coffee, they grow more patient and they're like timer resets. So you can have more time to get their food ready and that's really nice. I'm sorry guys, I'm working as fast as possible. Here's your ice cream. And let's make another ice cream really quick. Here we go. Oh no, our display shelves are gonna get empty. Okay. Oh, I didn't cook the ice cream or make the ice cream. Okay, here. It gets so stressful so quickly. There you go. Let me clean this. Oh gosh, our display shelves are going to get really empty and we need to cook for our customers. I'm sorry. I'm trying. Let me... Let me get the display shelves first and then I'll go, oh, we're not gonna have time to cook that person's bagel, are we? Okay, okay, let's speed cook it. I think they're gonna leave, I'm so sad. This is, I never miss orders. I'm just so nervous because you guys are here. Oh my gosh, please, no. We're running out of time, please. This could not go any faster. Come on, come on. Okay, wait, we actually might have had a time. I gave it to the wrong person. I'm so sorry. Okay, I realized that my camera had died. I'm so sorry. We're trying to use the new fancy camera today and of course it dies. It's because it took me so long to set up the camera. I'm so sorry, guys. I don't know how long it's been dead, but it's okay. We'll push through without the camera. We don't need the camera to continue. I'm embarrassed because we, we missed that person's order, so don't look at me. Don't perceive me. Camera is now off. That was a pretty okay day. I'm gonna go ahead and water the plants. We made $81. We had one missed order. That was pretty sad. I really wish that we didn't miss that, but I don't think we have enough money to really unlock anything. This is everything that I've unlocked so far. We need the cat cafe upgrade. That's what I'm saving up for as well, so we'll need three seven for that also the animal brush so we don't have to keep the animals clean all the time that's 165 we could afford that i guess we could get that right now there's also an oven upgrade carrots apples bees i don't really prioritize these because i'm not using those ingredients anyways this is the sprinkler i want the sprinkler so bad but i don't know i feel like the animals get really dirty way quicker than the plants need to be watered so I'm going to go ahead and um, get that. So we only have to brush them once a day and then they'll be clean for good. That sounds pretty nice to me because they keep getting dirty so quickly. It's the next day. This day, maybe, maybe this day will be a little bit better. <laughs> this is day 50, I think, um, on, on the bakery. I almost said on the island, on the Animal Crossing island. No, on the bakery. I think this is day 50. I don't know like if I've, if I've unlocked a lot for being on this game for 50 days. I've never really seen anyone else play it, so I haven't really like set a standard for myself. I'm just like not rushing, taking my time, just enjoying this cute little bakery game. It's so fun, even though it can be a little crazy at some points as you may have seen like i said i like to fill up all of the display shelves and these little tables in here before we start the day that way we have a good stock before the day begins and yeah we can be less stressed i think the bakery's ready to go ahead and start um start the morning start the day i already got this clean 
and I'm gonna just go ahead and refill these with some firewood even though they're not out I already know they're they're probably close to being out uh, welcome in I'll go ahead and take your order you want an ice cream we can we can do that for you let me just put that together here we go voila there you are enjoy your ice cream at 8 45 in the morning interesting choice and you you would like a bagel okay the ice creams are so like low stress to make i just looked at the camera like i was about to talk to you guys but i forgot that my camera died so i'm really sad let's refill this oh the lunch rush is starting here we go um yeah we're, we're doing pretty good though i need a clean um, maybe I should actually get some more ingredients because we're kind of running low. Oh no, the ovens are running out of firewood. So let me refill those. Of course, right when the lunch rush is happening, this is all going down. Okay, we need to hurry up. There's like, I can hear people buying all of our pastries and yeah, okay, this is really stressful. Let me take this out. Don't burn. I'll be back for you. Oh no, oh no. Okay, let's put this out. Oh no, please don't burn. Okay. Oh gosh, the lunch rush always gets too crazy for me. Here you go. Let me put this out. Let's go cook another cherry jelly for our customer. Oh my gosh, this is getting so crazy already. Let me just cook all this up. I'm getting stressed. I'm getting stressed. Okay, tables need to be cleaned. All right, let me clean that. Oh my gosh, the display shelves are like almost completely empty. Let me cook up a little marshmallow twist and I'll put that there. Let's grab this. Let's start making a lot of marshmallow treats because the shelves are empty and so many people are at the shelves trying to buy pastries. Oh no, okay. Here you go. I'm just like making them one by one. People are just buying them. Marshmallow treats is all that we can serve. Okay, there we go. Now, this person needs a blueberry bagel, so let's go get these ingredients really quick. Okay, it's the evening time, so things are going to start slowing down. Let's just go ahead and give coffee to these customers so that they'll be patient. We can clean this table and let me grab their bagel i'll go ahead and put that there and then let's make this ice cream for the other customer oh we unlocked a recipe i'm gonna get the milk chocolate i'm gonna get the milk chocolate that sounds pretty fun to make our last customer there you are and while they finish eating i'll go ahead and sweep up our bakery make sure it's all nice and clean okay bye guys i hope that you've all enjoyed um your experience here sorry things got a little slow at the end that was a successful day we oh oh my gosh inspector mustache is here we need to catch some bugs i love this mini game i think it's really fun and we get extra money for catching bugs so we need to try to catch as many as possible but that was a pretty successful day we didn't burn anything we didn't miss any orders this time so that was nice since we missed an order the day before i never miss orders i swear it was just because you guys were there and i was nervous where are like all the bugs i feel like i'm not catching enough um i need the money please 16 oh, man that's not even that good normally i get like 18 but it's okay so now we have 123 dollars um, that's not enough to really buy anything yet, so I'm just gonna go ahead and go to the next day, and I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. I would turn on my camera so that you guys could see me, but it's still dead, I think. Let me see. Yeah, it's, it's still dead. <laughs> Charge the battery pack. I don't know if you guys could see that, but yeah, anyways, here, I'll just... I'll use my character to look at you. Um, thank you so much for watching another episode of Cozy Saturday. I hope that you guys enjoyed the update on my lemon cake bakery. If you did, let me know in the comments. Also, leave a like and subscribe for more cozy gaming content. If you have any ideas on what games I should play for this series, be sure to also leave those down below in the comments. I would appreciate it very much. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night. I will see you guys next week with another episode. Bye!